Channel 5's Milkshake and I'm here to tell you that it's time for your Letters and Sounds Phonic Lesson. Hello children, I'm Rachel. Let's start our Letters and Sounds lesson and learn to read some new words. Let's begin by reading some phonemes that you already know. I'll show you the graphemes on the cards and I want you to read them aloud. This first card says sh and this digraph says e. Okay, your turn now. Are you ready? Go. Good job. Let's check you got them right. Read aloud with me. E, A, I, O, O or O, uh. R, O, R, uh. OW, OI, EAR, AIR, YOUR, ER. Uh. Great job, well done. Right, I'm going to mix them up now, remember, so they're going to be in a different order. And I want to hear you saying the sounds out loud. Are you ready? Off you go. Good job. Well done. Read aloud with me. Let's check. Uh, ow, ah, uh, or, e, a, whoop, sh, i, o, u, or, uh, uh, oi, ear, air, your. Super sounds, well done. Now let's read some words with graphemes that we already know and play a little game. Have a look at this word. Can you spot the digraph? Yes, good job. The digraph is ch. Read each sound as I point and then blend to read the word. Now look at the pictures. Point to the picture that matches the word. Let's check. B, E, N, CH. Bench. Here is the bench. Did you get it right? Good job. Now let's have a look at this word. Can you spot the digraph? Yes, the digraph is th. Read each sound as I point and blend to read the word. Look at the pictures. Point to the picture that matches this word. Th-i-n-k. Think. Here is someone thinking. Did you get it right? Let's have a look at this word now. No digraphs here. Read each sound as I point and then blend to read the word. Now look at the pictures again. Point to the picture that matches this word. N -e -s -t. Nest. Here is a nest. Did you get it right? Good job. Okay, last word. Are there any digraphs? No, no digraphs here. Read each sound as I point and then blend to read the word. Look at the pictures. Point to the picture that matches this word. T -e -n -t. Tent. Here is the tent. Did you get it right? Great reading. Now I'm going to mix the words up so that they're in a different order. Can you read the words on the cards? Without any help, I want you to read them aloud. Off you go. Let's 
Let's check. Read them with me. Nest. Think. Tent. Bench. Fantastic. Great reading. Well done. Today, we're going to practice reading some more words with graphemes that we already know. First, let's sound talk some words. Copy me. Say the sounds and then see if you can blend the sounds to say the word. Are you ready? Try this one. Sh, i, f, t. Sh, i, f, t. Your go. Sh, i, f, t. Shift. She helped me shift the boxes away from the door. Let's try another. Sh, r, i, n, k. Sh, r, i, n, k. Your go. Sh, r, i, n, k. Shrink. I often shrink my clothes in the wash. Let's try one more. K, r, i, s, p. K, r, i, s. R -i -sp. Crisp. She offered me her last crisp. Now let's read some words. Each time I want you to hunt for the digraphs and trigraphs and then say each sound and blend the sounds to say the word. Are you ready? Let's look at this one first. Can you spot the digraph? Yes, the digraph is shh. Let's hear you. Shh. -i Shift. She helped me shift the boxes away from the door. Next word. Is there a digraph? Yes. Shh. Good job. Ready. Sh -e shelf. I put the money box on my shelf in my bedroom. Digraph. Good job. Yes. Shh. Again. Are you ready? together. Sh, r, i, n, k. Shrink. I often shrink my clothes in the wash. Digraph. Yes, it's there again, isn't it? Shh, are you ready? Let's hear you. W, e, l, sh. Welsh. They flew the Welsh flag. Any digraphs? Ready. K -r -i -sp. Crisp. Oh, do you like crisps? I do. Last word. Digraph. Okay, ready. Read with me. B -e -t. Belt. Have you got a belt to help you keep your trousers up? Good job. Okay, let's see if you can read them aloud now without any help. Are you ready? Let's check. Read them with me. Shift. Shelf. Shrink. Welsh. Crisp. Belt. Ooh, mixing up time. I'm going to mix them up so they're in a different order and let's see if you can read them again. Are you ready? Off you go. Great job. Let's check. Belt. Welsh. Shelf. Shift, shrink, crisp. Now guess what? I am going to mix them up again. Super speedy this time without any help. Are you ready? Go. Uh, 
Fantastic. Let's check. Read them with me. Crisp. Shift. Welsh. Belt. Shelf. Shrink. Incredible. We are on fire again today, children. Well done. Now let's learn to read a tricky word. We are going to learn to read the word come. Well, the first bit is easy. K, but the second bit is tricky because these two letters together make the sound uh. Now read the word with me. K, uh, mm. Come. Awesome. Now read it yourself. What's the word? Sorry, what was that? Yes, the word is k a m come. Now, let's practice reading a tricky word that you have met before. Have a look at this one. You know how to read this tricky word. Can you remember the tricky bit? Yes, well done. The tricky bit is here. And this says e. Eh. Can you read the word? Well done. Let's read it together. S e eh said. Okay, should we try reading these words quickly now? I'm going to mix them up and I want to hear you reading them aloud. Are you ready? Let's check. Come. Said. Great reading. Well done. Now let's read some sentences with graphemes that we already know. Can you see any words with digraphs? Can you spot any? Er, uh, well done. Sh, l, e, well done. Can you see a tricky word that we read today? Yes, well done. The tricky word that we read today is said. Now, I want you to read aloud as I point to the words. Remember to sound out any words that you are not sure of. Off we go. Excellent reading. Now let's read the sentence together. Off we go. If my skirt shrinks, I will not need a belt on it, she said. Brilliant. Now let's read it again a little bit faster this time. Read with me as I point to the words. Off we go. If my skirt shrinks, I will not need a belt on it, she said. Mmm, I wonder how the skirt would shrink. Now, let's have a look at this sentence. Can you see any words with digraphs? Have a good look again. See any? Shh. Oh, well done. And e. Well done. Can you see a tricky word that we read today? Have you got it? Yes, the tricky word that we read today is come. Now I want you to read aloud as I point to the words. Remember to sound out any words you are not sure of. Off we go. Excellent reading. Now let's read the sentence together. My Welsh gran will come 
and visit us next week. Brilliant. Now let's read it again a little faster this time. Read with me as I point to the words. Are you ready? My Welsh gran will come and visit us next week. Well done. That was fantastic reading. I love it when my gran comes to visit. Splendid. Let's finish by spelling some words because if you can read a word, then you can have a go at spelling it. You will need your paper and something to write with. Have you got them? Are you ready? Great. Let's spell two words with graphemes that we already know. Let's spell crisp. Segment the sounds with me. Crisp. K -r -i -sp. Let's count how many sounds there are. Crisp. K -r -i -sp. That's five sounds. Watch me write crisp and remember we need five sounds. Okay. R I S P K R I S P Crisp. Okay, now I'm going to hide it. Now you have a go. Say the word. Say the sound. Remember how many we had? Five. Are you ready? Have you done? Let's check our spelling. K -r -i -s -p. Crisp. Did you get it right? Great job. You'll be able to write that on the shopping list now. Okay, let's try another one. Let's spell belt. Segment the sounds with me. Belt. B -e -l -t. Let's count how many sounds there are. B -e -l -t. Four sounds this time. Watch me write belt. And remember, four sounds. B T B -e -l -t. Belt. Hiding time. Are you ready? It's gone. You write it down. Say the word. Belt. Say the sounds. B -e -l -t. Write them down. Remember, four sounds. Okay. Are you ready? Okay, let's check. B -e -l -t. Belt. Did you get it right? Fantastic. Great job. Okay, now let's try and spell some tricky words. Let's write the word come. Okay, segment the sounds with me. Come. K -a -m. Let's count how many sounds we need. K -a -m. That's three sounds. Watch me write come. Can you remember the tricky bit? Mm, first bit's easy. K. The next bit is the tricky bit. Do you remember this? Okay, these two letters, the O and the E, work together to make the sound a. Uh. Do you remember that? So we've got k, a, uh, m, mm, come. Let's do that again. K, a, uh, m, mm, 
come have a really good look because this is what your word needs to look like. There's one, two, three, there's four letters that you need to write down. Have a go. I'm going to hide it. Have you had a good look? Good job. Say the word. Come. Say the sounds. Come. Uh. Can you remember the tricky bit? The letter O and E make the sound. Uh. Write them down. Good job. Shall we check? Uh, mm, come. Does yours look like that? <gasps> Amazing! Well done! Okay, let's try another one. Let's write a tricky word we've done before. Let's spell the word said. Okay, can you say the se Let's segment it together first. Say the sounds. Ready? Said. S -e -d. Check that. How many were there? S, E, D, said. <gasps> Three sounds. Ooh, let's write it down. Watch me write it. Can you remember the tricky bit? First bit's easy. S, now the tricky bit. Do you remember? These two letters are making the sound E. Last bit's easy for us. D. S. E. D. Said. Whoa, have a good look, because guess what I'm going to do? I am going to hide it, yes. It's gone. Okay, say the word. Said. Say the sounds. Said. Write them down. Are you ready? Let's check. Remember, s, e, d, said. Does yours look like this? Oh, you are fantastic today. Well done, children. You've worked so hard with all your reading and all your spelling, and I am so proud of you. I'll see you next time for another lesson with letters and sounds. Bye. Well, there you go. I hope you enjoyed your letters and sounds lesson. Well done for all your effort. I hope you enjoyed it. I certainly did. And why don't you share a lovely story tonight with someone in your family? Enjoy your book, enjoy your evening, and have a wonderful day. Good luck. Bye.